What's going on guys? Uh, uploading the next vlog. Uh, sorry guys, it's been a couple weeks um, since I've uploaded. It's been a rough couple weeks. Uh, unfortunately, my sister's husband, um, my brother-in-law Walter, passed away um, about a week and a half ago. So it's been very crazy, hectic. Um, it was very unexpected. God brought me here though. He brought me here to Biloxi to spend time with my sister, my brother-in-law. Um, he just knows, man. I mean, I know a lot of you guys probably don't believe in that kind of thing, but I do. Uh, God definitely brought me here to spend this time with him and them all together um, while I've been doing this journey. Um, and I'm thankful for that. Um, so I don't want it to be a, a, a you know, monotone vlog though i wanted to be a positive vlog because in this vlog i was going to be going to reno um here tomorrow actually uh but after all this happened i just can't leave my sister here she's coming to reno for the first time uh hopefully we can uh have a pretty good time she's going to be playing some cash i think she's going to hop in a tournament or two i'm going to be on the tournament grind um hopefully i can take something down for walter what's going on guys um as you guys can see before i leave for this trip i need to i gotta cut my hair so uh yeah here it goes whoa all right that feels much better already tonight we've already packed so we're good to go morning we're gonna it's very early in the morning we're gonna leave out so uh the next piece of uh footage you're gonna see is gonna be in the airport probably some footage from the plane and good old reno have a good one guys it's the speaker knockers dropped Alina off in the front at the terminal which is parked we in uh, New Orleans right now. Uh -oh, about to get on the flight. First flight to Vegas. Next flight to Reno. See ya. Scare money don't make no money. If, if, if I ever go broke, I'ma take your money. What's up, y'all? Just landed in Vegas. Vegas. But we're going to Reno, obviously. If I ever go broke, I'ma take your money, uh, your money. You run your mouth too much, why can't you keep a secret, bitch? Yeah. These niggas lying, hell no, I am not believing it. My girl is Spanish, so she eat is that money and shit. Got a new bitch every three months, I'm on some season shit. I do what I do, and the people, they like it because I'm a G with this. All right, guys, going into the room. No, I ain't. <laughs> All right, now I'm going into the room. Uh, first time, let's check it out. See what they got. Let's see what kind of rooms they got. Let's go. Scare money don't make no money. If, if, if I ever go broke, I'ma take your money. What's going on guys? We're about to 
head down right now for our first tournament. It's gonna be the 125 win the button. Look at this shot. Wow. I'm pumped. I'm pumped. We're about to take it down. One and two, right? One and two? One. No. Okay, whatever. Okay, one and two, you know. Either way, I'll be happy either way though. But um, see you guys soon. I'm gonna show you uh, a little bit of what they have down there. And uh, see ya. I need this cash. I need it fast. I need it fast. I come for your ass. Like I'm down for my last finesse for the rest. Scare money don't make no money. So give me the money, money. The fifties and hundreds, hundreds, stomach. bring you another update I uh, busted busted the tournament um, yesterday now it's morning uh, the next morning but I, I busted the tournament pretty early I never really got anything going sister went pretty deep though she uh, she was about I think about 10 spots off the money uh, then I hopped in this Thursday thriller satellite which was nice satellite nice ran satellite um, but busted about six spots from the seat so a little rocky start but you know it's not about how you start it's about how you finish and uh we plan on finishing strong so uh get ready it's happening Scare money don't make no It's been it's an electric event. I'm talking about people are just all in and, and happy about it. I love it. I love the the way this tournament is going. Feeling good. Uh, wish me luck. Let's see. Let's go. It's happening. Now he needs you now. Congratulations. There was a player with you. <laughs> Well done, sir. Well done. Let's go! Go stone bubble. In the money! Flexing, I be flexing, be flexing and finessing. Flexing and finessing, I be flexing and finessing. Yeah, flexing and finessing, I be flexing and finessing. All right, guys, heading to the room now. Just uh, busted in ninth place. Uh, Brad Owen busted in 10th. We kind of talked at the, uh, you know, when we was getting our cash and on the way down to the poker room. He's, he's a really, really chill guy. Um, you really, really have to get lucky in those all-in-a-fold tournaments, <laughs> obviously. You only have two options, but uh, we did good. Made some money. Cash for six fifty, so pretty decent. Good, how you doing? Thanks. Yeah, well, so it's pretty decent. Um, we're going to be, you know, buying into the Thriller satellite in the morning. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Two hundred dollar satellite. Winner gets the eleven hundred dollar seat. So we're gonna do it. We're gonna keep this thing going. Let's go. Alright guys, heading down for the satellite. Uh, ready to keep this thing happen. 
this will be a pretty big turn if I can get it to the satellite. So what it is is $1,100 buy-in. It is a bounty event. Each person you take out, you get a $500 chip. So let's make our chips rise. Let's go. All right, guys, the satellite didn't go that well. Um, I wasn't able to uh, win. I came in third, only first paid. So tonight we have the Bounty um, PLO 6 Max tournament. I'm pretty good at PLO. I can't wait for this 6 Max. Let's go now. What's going on guys? We're going in for day one of the main event here. It's a $600 buy-in with a $200,000 guarantee. There's two day one start days, today, Friday, and then they have start day on Saturday. And day two is on Sunday. Uh, they're gonna be streaming this live on Twitch at runitup.tv. So uh, it's gonna be a pretty nice event. I'm looking forward to it. Ready to do some damage here. It's the speaker knockers. What's going on, folks? Heading to go eat. Uh, today is a lazy day. I didn't play the second day of the main after busting the first day. It just didn't seem like the right thing to do. Um, heading to go eat now at this uh, Italian joint they have here. So, at least that'll be fun. See ya. If, if I ever go broke, I'ma take your money. Well, I decided to get back into the main event. Um, I went in after dinner break on day 1B. Uh, was doing good. Started off my very first hand, doubled up. We started with 25,000 chips. I was up to 70 within the, the first orbit. I was just killing it. Um, I got up to about 120 or so when the very last hand of the night happened. I raised on the button, big blind re-raises. Uh, we're at uh, 2400 big blind. Big blind re-raises me. And I know this is the last hand of the day. People are trying to get aggressive, win the last pot. I shove in my Queens. Um, I have the video here. I mean, it's going to be the wrong way because I couldn't even think about it, but take a look. Oh, for the vlog. Oh, for the vlog. Really? I'm in a vlog. <laughs> he called me with ace eight of heart for his tournament life. I just don't understand. He called me with like 90K for his tournament life and got there. I mean, I just don't understand why you would, the very last day, I mean the very last, um, not the very last level even, the very last hand of the night. He already called it. This is the last hand guys, everybody's bagging up for day two. And he's gonna call off with an ace eight. I just, I don't understand sometimes how they can just be rewarded for something like that. It just doesn't make any sense. Um, I don't get it, and I'm just feeling bummed. I only have like 22,000 chips now, less than starting stack. Um, after being up to 120K, over average, feeling good. I don't even want to go down tomorrow. I mean, to be honest, I don't even want to go down tomorrow. I, I thought this was it. I thought I was feeling good, playing good. I really thought this was it. I was supposed to have like 200K right there. Just, just, uh, really feeling bummed. Um, all right, guys, I'll give you guys an update tomorrow um, on how this 22K plays out. See ya. All right, guys, this is day two of the main event. Like I said, I'm starting with just 22,800 at 2,400 big blinds, so I got to get it in the middle. Let's see what happens. All right, guys, I'm out of the main, 133rd, 112 places paid, uh, shoved 
uh, the cutoff with Ace King. Jeff Gross woke up with Jax in the big blind. That's all she wrote. Bye, freaking real. No money. So give me the money, money. The fifties and hundreds, hundreds. I'm coming. Scared.